Now, crews in Morris, Illinois are still monitoring this industrial fire that led to a 24 hour mandatory evacuation. Thousands of residents had to leave the area with the Illinois National Guard helping out at the scene. That's where CBS 2's Google Digway is live this morning in Morris as crews assess the situation. How do things look right now, Mugo? Well, Ryan, I can tell you that fire is still burning, but this is as close as we're allowed to get to it for our own safety. If you look behind me right now, you can see there's a state police car out here. Further down, you can see several emergency crews, several cars out there, flashing lights. But I want to show you the other side, too, because this is what emergency crews are trying to avoid us from being in the area because of all of that smoke in the air. When we first got to this area, we were closer to the building where this fire is coming from, and we could see the huge plume of smoke in the air. So right now the focus is getting control of this fire and getting people back in their homes. We know this fire first broke out yesterday morning just after 1140. The company at the building is called Superior Battery. It's a warehouse on Benton and East Street. About 80 to 100 tons of large lithium batteries were being stored inside. So authorities are worried that that smoke could be a potential health risk, which is the reason for the mandatory evacuation that's now in place. Right now, the whole southeast side of Morris has been evacuated. That's about four to 5,000 people. 12 Illinois National Guard service members, five trucks and three trailers with chemical assessment and monitoring equipment were sent to to the site last night. Now, their role is to monitor air quality and assess the area to see when it's safe for people to return to their homes. Meanwhile, fire crews say their plan is to let the fire burn itself out. The building is doing very good for us. It's uh, it's keeping them explosions uh, inside. So them explosions are not coming outside of the building and you know, a battery uh, going across the street and striking uh, a property or something. So it's keeping it contained. So the mandatory evacuation order, that will remain in place until 9 tonight. But that could also change depending on how conditions and what things out here look like. We're also expecting to hear from fire officials and city officials at 10 this morning. And we'll, of course, keep you updated on what comes out of that. We're live in Morris, Illinois. Mugodigwe, CBS 2 News.